Heaven High. Yes, Heaven High will be my new intro because the old one, H-E-L-L-O, is and always has been a curse in disguise, from what I hear. So, I decided to go with it. Total opposite. Heaven High. And the new ongoing task of breaking the old habit. It's not going to be easy because it's too easy of a thing to casually forget. I gotta try. After doing a shitload of research along with a logical bit of thinking, I've come to realize all roads really do lead to Rome. Kind of freaky how many roads actually do lead to Rome. Literally. Magic and spellcasting differ not. Somehow, looking up black magic has led me back to the Bible. Seems like everything does. And with the Vatican being in Rome, you can see how all Rome roads actually do lead there. Okay, so magic in our language, in our lives, and it's mentioned in the Bible. Many of my rabbit hole researches have led me to look into Holy Scripture, God's in all things. The magic got me to look into the occult. Puzzle patterns always come together in the big picture. The secret cult has hidden the biggest truths of our reality by mocking the truth and tricking the masses to see a reality that does not exist. More than that, we, the people, have been molded by inception. We've been violated by an invasion of the mind. Ideas are implants, the mo are implanted the moment we are able to learn. Programs and our favorite source of entertainment slash babysitter, the TV, the perfect tool for inception. The television is, in my opinion, the perfect way to imprint images, stories, etc. into the human mind and psyche and therefore teach. It has and always will be corrupt, twisting the minds of 99% of us to see reality the way they want us to see it, giving us, humanity, a modern perspective of a false, meaningless existence, which leads many of the zombified into unexplained depression. I call it the what's the point factor. It's when you think life is a random accident and nothing matters. That's exactly what belief in the Big Bang Theory and infinite nothingness does to people. It shrinks us down to insignificant specks that truly don't matter in the big picture. Erasing the truth about our loving creator, Yahweh, and leading most, if not all, of his people astray. By turning the Holy Bible, a Quran, etc., holy book, pretty much God's word, into a joke. And at the same time, it mocks its readers as crazy church people. Hey, did you know the Pope co-owns the world's largest telescope with NASA? Huh? Well, did you know what they named it? Lucifer! They named the world's largest and most powerful telescope Lucifer. Crazy but true. Okay, please like and subscribe because uh, I want to build an army of truth-seeking souls to battle the demented forces of evil in the name of Jesus to learn the meaning of God's will and comply. It's important to stay righteous. It's a spiritual war. Take the high road for the most high. Love your family. Forgive your enemies. Repent your sin. God bless and guide us all.